What's up guys, Justin here with the SketchupEssentials.com back with another SketchUp extension overview for you. In today's video, we're going to talk about an extension that allows you to map textures properly to different faces in your SketchUp model. Um, I do want to take a second and thank my supporters on Patreon. Patreon, as most of you know, is the website where you can support creators that you like on YouTube. Um, in addition, my Patreon supporters get to vote on which extension I'm going to cover every week. So this week, the extension that they voted on is Wrapper. Plugin name, Wrapper. Plugin developer, Shader Tech. Plugin cost, $69. Where can you get it? You can get it by visiting the sketchupessentials.com slash wrapper. Tool functions. One of the things that can be challenging with 3D models is trying to apply textures to diff difficult faces so that they show up properly in your model. As you know, SketchUp models are made up of a lot of little faces, and sometimes materials don't map properly to those faces. In addition, when you export models to things like Unreal Engine, your materials sometimes don't map properly, so you need to use an extension in order to map the materials to those faces. Today's extension helps you prepare surfaces in SketchUp for texture application. For example, let's say you have a curved face and you try to apply a texture to it. Whenever you do this, SketchUp doesn't apply the image to the face properly. However, what an extension like Wrapper does is allows you to unwrap your faces in your models and map them for textures. You can adjust the seams in your model by selecting them within SketchUp or by adjusting things within the Wrapper application itself. This allows you to quickly and easily make changes to your UV mapping in your model. In addition, Wrapper comes with some smart selection tools that allow you to select things like edge loops or paths in your model so that you can unwrap really quickly. It also supports Export to Substance Painter, which is an industry-leading texturing app. Within the Wrapper window, it gives you a live unwrap view of your objects so you can see exactly what you're dealing with. Within this window, you can adjust your seams, rotate and move your unwrapped objects, as well as scale them to match them up with your textures. You can view a checker pattern, a colors or numbers pattern, or your actual SketchUp texture to see exactly how things are being mapped within your model. The developers of Wrapper built the Wrapper window with the same general navigation controls as SketchUp to make using it as easy as possible. I actually struggle with UV mapping in general, but this extension makes wrapping my mind around it a lot easier. All in all, this extension allows you to visually see exactly what you're doing when UV mapping your textures. While working with UV maps is still a complicated process, this extension tries to make it easy. Download the free trial and see if it's something that works for you. That's where I'm going to end today's video. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you thought. Is this something you're interested in? Um, do you have as much trouble uh, with UV mapping as I do? I just love having that SketchUp conversation with you guys. If you like this video, please remember to click that like button down below. If you're new around here, remember to click that subscribe button for new SketchUp content every week. Um, if you like what I'm doing on this channel, please consider supporting me on Patreon. Every little bit helps, even if it's only a dollar a month. But in any case, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. I really appreciate it, and I will catch you in the next video. Thanks, guys.